Bulgaria. Excellencies, dear colleagues, I would like to express my sincere gratitude to the President of the Republic of Korea for the invitation to participate in the third Summit for Democracy. This forum is a valuable tool to facilitate the international exchange of ideas and good practices for democratic development. Therefore, we are deeply thankful to the Republic of Korea for hosting this event. Since the first Summit for Democracy in 2021, the challenges to the international peace and human rights have increased in number and magnitude. In this context, fighting corruption on national level is the main commitment a government can take to safeguard democracy. The national anti-corruption policies represent a crucial guarantee for national security, stability and sovereignty. Hence, they were the focus of two consecutive Bulgarian governments within the framework of the last year of action. In line with the national commitments, in 2023 Bulgaria undertook key legislative amendments to reinforce the independence of its national judiciary and to strengthen the accountability of the Public Prosecution Office. To this end, the Parliament has adopted constitutional amendments and a new anti-corruption law, which are to consolidate the efforts to prevent, detect, investigate and prosecute corruption crimes. The adoption of these new legal tools, however, represents only the necessary first step. The government and the public administration have yet to secure in practice the successful implementation and the effectiveness of the new legislation. We ought to remain aware that fighting corruption is a long-term priority and this topic should remain pertinent. Excellencies, safeguarding democracy is impossible unless we convince our societies that it works for them, that this is the one form of government where every human life matters equally and where human dignity represents a true value. Guided by this conviction, Bulgaria has placed the respect, protection and promotion of democracy, human rights and fundamental freedoms at the core of its foreign policy. These values will underpin the membership of Bulgaria in the UN Human Rights Council for the next two years. In conclusion, I would like to assure you that Bulgaria is looking forward to continuing its cooperation with fellow democracies in order to stand up for our shared values and for promoting democratic principles at home, regionally and internationally.